Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Ready or Not video. He's down, he's down. Jesus Christ. So this is one of the new test levels. There's three new test levels in this Ready or Not update. This is uh, for supporter editions only right now uh, for playtesting purposes. I'll throw a flashbang in here. Um, I want them to start doing more maps like this. I want smaller maps that we can we can breach dynamically not these super overly large maps which not all of them are large I'm not saying that either way this is freaking amazing this new update is great we get these guys secured here I don't want to show off too much of the test levels um, but this is just an example of what they're working on like I said there's three new test levels uh, in this new update as well as a bunch of other changes he's got a gun he's running all the way around the building here we're gonna have to catch up to him shit all right let me get red team on me i'm gonna throw a banger behind the dumpster here he must have ran inside so before we get into the action and like i said we will go back and uh we'll do all those test maps in another video there's three of them uh, i want to go through some of the big changes the the large changes in this new update which like i said before this is exclusive for supporter editions right uh supporter edition owners right now and in the future uh hopefully not too long from now standard edition will get all of this plus anything else that they decide to add also i'm gonna put the entirety of the patch notes of what they have so far i'm gonna put it in an Emger, and I'm gonna put the link down in the description for you guys to check out if you'd like to do that as well. So some major things, we got three new test maps which include Valley, Fast Food, and Compound, which like I said, they're test maps. There's a bunch of missing textures and stuff like that. It's a work in progress. We're gonna check that out in another video. Other biggest change is the, uh, they changed how the suspects react. Um, instead of just John wicking you around the corner, uh, the first three bullets that they fire has an accuracy penalty, which nine times out of 10, I believe they're just not gonna hit you. So it gives you a, some time to react, which I think is really good instead of running a bunch of AI mods. Obviously, I'm probably going to install some in the future anyway, um, but until they come up with some type of other solution to help with the AI, I think this is a good change for right now. Also, this is a pretty large one as well. We did get some other guns that I mentioned that I didn't get to mention in my older videos, uh, along with the BCM MK1 and the SCAR. Uh, we're also going to be receiving a VK VKS, a Glock 19 Generation 5 and an SLR 47. And we got some updates to the M9 as well, which I showcased. Uh, there's some other quality of life uh, improvements to the weapon attachments. So as far as game mode additions go, and this is a huge one, on Hotel, we're receiving Active Shooter and Hostage Rescue. And these are going to include, include new areas to Hotel, which is the main lobby of the hotel and a first floor area, apparently. And I haven't checked this out yet, but that's gonna be the first thing we check out today in this video and along with that we have changes to meth which opens up a second house and gives us the raid game mode which i'd also like to check out uh, other than that we've got dealer and port with uh one new game mode bomb threats and i don't believe either of those have any uh uh additional map openings but maybe we'll see some in the future all right so before we jump into the action we're gonna check out these new weapons and i'm gonna kind of showcase them for you guys can so you can see what you're gonna be uh uh getting to use uh when this comes out for the standard edition owners so right here we've got the r7 launcher uh which is a pepper ball gun and like an ar style it looks really cool right now i've got the holographic side on it with a flashlight let's go ahead and shoot a couple rounds and see how it performs so there is no fully automatic which is probably a good thing animations are really smooth it looks like we've got a t okay so i must have dropped one magazine yeah so it looks like we got a total of four magazines so that's pretty cool and then next we're going to be checking out the mk1 carbine which is also a new ar edition we'll check it out unsuppressed first and then we'll throw a suppressor on it again these names are changed just for the sake of uh, i guess legal issues and stuff like that too As you can tell, it does have a unique sound compared to the other AR platforms. Smooth animations. Let's try full auto. 
so as far as full auto goes and, and just like the way the gun performs, I can tell it has a lot less recoil than the HK. But it's not that much. All right, we're throwing the suppressor on this bad boy right here as well as another sight. And I'm gonna see how this thing sounds with the suppressor on. I really do like how it has a unique sound for the suppressor as well. Looks good, performs well. All right, now we're gonna check out the MK16. All right, so this this weapon does look a little bit different than the uh, the scar that we were looking at in the weapon unlocker. I still think it looks good. I just wish we could get a version with like a larger barrel in the front too. Recoil is not that bad. Not my favorite sight, but... Alright, let's throw a suppressor on it. Let's change up the sight real quick. Little bit more kick than the uh, the other rifle that we were just using, but I mean, it's still, it seems like it would pack a punch because it's a scar, right? Looks good. Uh, and last but not least, we got the, uh, well, we do have a few more pistols, but anyway, uh, the SLR 47, which is like an 8K platform, doesn't have a lot of options for sights. It's like the, the mini sights or the micro sights, and then we got the one RMR sight. This thing kicks a lot. Oh yeah, that is, that is crazy. Let's dump a magazine and then see the fast reload. That looks badass though. Let's see what it sounds like with the suppressor real quick. That is a chunky sounding suppressor. It's really cool though. I like how they're adding in uh, AK platforms though. Okay, so for the additions for the pistols, let's see here. So we got the Glock 19 Gen 5, which looks really nice. And we got the uh, the P92X, which is the M9 uh, variant uh, updated, which looks really cool from what I can see. Let's check out the Glock 19 first. As far as the attachments go, I think it's about the same. Got the tack light on it, and then we got the glow sights. Bridgicon night sights. It looks good. Pretty clean. Glock is probably my favorite, honestly. All right, so the P92X, same thing with this one. Similar uh, attachments to the other. I got the attack light on it. Oh yeah. I like this a lot, honestly. Looks really good. Okay, so that's going to be all the additions for the new weapons here. Let's go ahead and jump into a map. Let's check out this new hotel. I'm excited. Let's get into some action. Okay, so again, um, you can see a lot of new locations here. So this is a test level down here. It's the fast food place. Got a test level up here, compound, and then Valley of Dolls. I did jump in really quickly just to check it out, and they're all test maps. They're, they're not textured, and they're not finished and all that, right? Um, so we're jumping in a hotel. You can notice right away, we've got active shooter. We've got hostage rescue. Apparently, if you look at the patch notes, I took a peek at them and there is some changes to hostage rescue. I know back before this update, every time you'd shoot your weapon or any time the sub subjects would hear you, uh, they would instantly shoot the hostages. So I do want to check this out, but I have a feeling it is going to be 
insanely hard, as you can tell, the difficulty is insane. Uh, doing this with AI, so I'm gonna wait till I do it with co-op. We're gonna jump into active shooter, and again, it looks like we're going to have the ability to check out the new area. So let's get in here. Oh, I'm excited. Oh my god, no way. This is exactly... <laughs> Dude, this is exactly what it looked like in the trailer. Oh my god, this makes me so happy. You have no idea. This looks phenomenal. Okay, let's go ahead and have these guys stack up. Now, this is an active shooter mission, so we have to be aggressive. We have to be quick. Alright, I'm gonna bash it open. Let's do this, boys. Go, 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 go. Get in, get in, get in. Don't be blocking the door. Oh, this just looks fucking phenomenal, dude. I love this so much. I'm gonna flash deep here. On my six. They're starting to shoot people. Make me shoot. He's down. The suspect has expired. Talk reporting. Copy that if you I know there's some doors back there, but I heard shooting, so we gotta get moving. Door closed left. Shots fired right. Shots fired right. Go, go, go. Going with them. Let's go. Fuck. Multiple subjects down. Multiple civvies down, rather. Roger that. Continue we got a dead suspect here. On me. Got a shooter. We got a shooter. Let's move. Notify trailers. Civilian is DOA. Talk reporting. Another one. Another one. Another one. He's down. Changing. Flashbang going in. Door open left. Civilian is DOA. Talk to entry team. Copy that entry team. Notifying morgue. Multiple civvies down. Disarm the trap. trap quietly. Copy that. I'm gonna have red team come with All me. In. We need to secure these guys ASAP. The suspect is expired. Talk to element. Police get Talk down. Copies all. Proceed okay, we got the firearm on this guy. Where's the secondary firearm? Cover us. Moving up. Oh my god, where is this? Okay, we don't have time. We gotta keep moving. The civilian has expired. Repeat, civilian is DOA. Talk reporting. Copy that, entry team. Notifying morgue. Okay, we got another open door, so I don't know if we should hit the garage now or if we should wait. Maybe we should come back for the garage. Let's go ahead and everybody... Oh, shit. On my six. That was one of the new alarm traps. Why are there traps on an active shooter? That doesn't that doesn't make sense to me. All right, we got a door open front and a door closed right. Let's go ahead and wedge door closed right. Go ahead and flashbang this, and we're gonna clear it. I'm gonna have them take point. Now I am playing really aggressive compared to how I normally would, just because it's an active shooter. Situation. Okay, we got an open corridor here. Let's go ahead and have blue on me. Got a door closed right. Let's go ahead and get this secured. Wedged. We got more civvies down. I think this is gonna wrap back around where we came from. Yes, okay, that's the main lobby. We've got a dead suspect here. Talk to element. Okay, now we have another door closed here. Okay, let's let that team secure that area for now. Contact. Hands up above your head. Put your hands up. I'm gonna wedge this and we'll come back to it. Let's clear this side first. 
Got another open corridor here. This is such a big area to clear. Holy shit. We got a lot of rooms. I think we got both the shooters. I don't know how many shooters are here. Are those handcuffs? Civilian good to go for evac. Talk to entry team. Suspect to your team. Okay, this wrap back around. Like I said, I know I'm... <sighs> okay, this is going to lead down into the garage, so that might go into where that other location was that we fell back to. So let's go ahead and regroup back around. Where does this go? Oh, I can't open this. Okay. The suspect is expired. A lot of down individuals. Holy shit. Floyd Kemlite! Floyd Kemlite! Okay, let's clear out this first as an element. Post up and cover. Copy that. Check the door. Open sesame. Right, let's go ahead and flash Open and clear. Bag and clear. All right, Roger that. Go go go. Left side clear. Right side clear. Like another first floor area. Let's check this out first. Lighting looks really good. Okay, that's my wedge door. The new talk sounds great. Much better than before. So we're not getting negative points for these down individuals here. So that means that these guys are static bodies, most likely. Okay, let's uh let's get them to disarm this trap here. Quietly. Getting rid of the trap now. Let's uh on my six. Have blue team fall in. Let's have red team disarm, disarm it. Trap. I think I think that just Yeah. Fall in behind me. I'm on your six. Disable okay. that trap. I see what's going on here. Sorry, I was I'm so used to I haven't played with the AI in a while and I don't have the things above their heads, so I can't see who's who, which I should probably enable that, but for immersion reasons, I don't like to keep that up. So go ahead and check if it's open. It's open. Let's have them flash it. Toss a flashbang. Let's have blue team watch our back while we go in with red. Okay, roger that. On a move. They're having some problems. I'm gonna open it for them. Come on. Open it. Toss a flashback. There we go. Go, go, go. Left side clear, right side clear. Got some blood here, but no down subjects. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Open the door. Clear it. Looks like a stairwell. I'm on you guys. Copy that. It's open. We're good to go. Let's move. Moving up. Yeah, we got a garage that goes down here. That looks like it's blocked off. I'm gonna look peek through these windows. Move out of the way. Light stick That's away. gonna lead into a garage. So let's get this wedged. And I just want to double check and make sure this goes where I think. Can you get the fuck out of the way? Need to get into position. Yeah, so that's that's blocked off. Okay. So we'll come back around here. Let's clear this side. And we still have another room that we got to clear as well that we completely bypassed. So far, this map looks so good. I don't know why they didn't... They should allow you to have the option to, to go oh, between man. different sections of the level when they unlocked. But I guess I understand why they're locked behind... Uh, game modes and stuff like that. It makes sense. But this does this does just look great. It looks so good. Okay, is this an actual door? I'm gonna pie this here. This is an actual door. Can't really see. Left side looks like it's gonna open up pretty large here. Open bang and clear. Let's flash this right. out. Roger that. Go go go. 
Right side clear. Looks like that's going to be a dead door. Yep. I don't even think that's a word, but can't go through there. It's boarded up. Okay, right side's going to be clear. This is going to lead back to where we were, I think, possibly. I'm going to take point. That's the door that we wedged. Okay, I know where we are. Got a subject. Down on your knees. Put your hands up. Oh, get away from me. Cover me. Potential on me. Right behind you. That's gonna go to the left. Gotta be careful with that angle. Hey, get on the ground here, now. Make him secure. Civilian in sight. Okay, we're clear left. Restrain targets. Contact in custody. All right, coming out. Let's have red team stack up. Roger that. Talk reporting. Copy entry team. Notifying trailers. Probably going to miss some of the bodies, but that's okay. This is our first run through, right? So. Open clear with flashbangs. Yeah, copy that. I'm going to take care of this wedge while they're working that door. Roger that. We'll take care of Ready to move. Please don't flash me. Be pissed. Let's go. I'll move. Targets. Oh, this is a nice little area here. This one's it's secure. open though, which is dangerous. Got multiple doors. Ready for okay, we got a soft complete, but we're gonna continue because I want to see the rest of the map here. So it looked like it was just those two suspects on the right-hand side uh, area of the map. So let's go ahead and have blue team cover. On me. Red team. Oh, Looks like these might be bathrooms or something, so let's clear these out slowly. Yep, see, we got more down individuals anyway, so we might as well continue. Police, hands up. Talk Excuse me. Copy that, oh. entry team. Notifying more. Hands up. Drop your knees. So it doesn't really make sense to me as to why they would add traps on this level. I really, I don't know, it bothers me because it's an active shooter. I guess it makes it a little bit more difficult, but still. Oh, this leads into a whole nother back area too. Holy shit. On me. I don't understand. They did a really good job with this mission. Holy shit, man. This is great. We might as well clear out this whole back hallway here just to make sure we're not missing any bodies. Okay, we did come from there. Okay, that was a corridor that we didn't clear. So that was my bad. I thought this came to an end right there, but it actually it was an intersection. Okay. Let's clear this out too. So, I don't know. I guess two suspects would make sense for an active shooter. Uh, we'll have to make a video and check out the... Um, the hostage rescue, that's probably, like I said, it's probably insane, but... Okay, let's clear this out. We don't have any suspects, but we still got these bodies that we gotta clear. Realistic setting, we wouldn't know if there's any suspects. If, or sorry, like, you know... From a video game standpoint, we know that there's no more suspects left. Okay, this is gonna be a little kitchen here. I think that leads back out. A storage area back here. Holy shit, this map is huge. Got some blood, got some more dead bodies. Civilian is down but breathing. Notify EMTs. Talk to entry team. Copy that entry team. Notifying morgue. Okay, this is the door that I jammed from earlier. Okay, that's why I love rock and door jams so much is because I know I know where I'm at I know where I'm going for the most part Especially in a level that I've never played before I instantly know. Okay, I've already been here And we got these bodies too. Yep, okay, so let's circle back around Have these guys uh, cover Moving up. 
So apparently you don't get your door wedges back, by the way, is, is, is what I is what I heard um, when you remove them. So that bothers me a little bit. Just to confirm. And there's a fucking alarm trap. Put your hands up. Is there no model for the alarm trap? Is it just it just does it? <laughs> it just the sound comes from nowhere or what? Is that what is that connected to? <laughs> yeah, I'm not a fan of the traps on some of these levels. I, I think it kind of makes no sense personally. Provide support on me. I mean, we're in an active shooter. When, when are they going to have time to set up traps? You know, it makes it hard though, right? From a video game from from a video game standpoint, it makes it more difficult, which I understand. Okay, so we're missing, um, so let's go back through here. This is where we got contact on two of those subjects. And let's just go check out the basement. We might have some down individuals there. Falling on me. On your six. Oh, there's another weapon here. Wait, wait, wait. So this must have been where the, where the weapon ended up. Yeah, this must have been from, uh, that guy right there that we killed. Oh wow, that's it? It doesn't actually lead into a garage? Or is it just blocked off? Okay, I thought it I thought it like actually led into okay. So it doesn't lead into a downstairs area. Gotcha. I think that's it then. I think we're good to soft complete. I don't know what we missed. Maybe we missed some bodies or Or maybe there is another area that I haven't seen yet. I'll quickly backtrack. Okay, so there was a grenade trap on that door. We didn't clear that area. I was unsure of that. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. They gotta... <laughs> There's no reason there should be traps on these fucking missions, dude. Not the active shooters. Come on. All right, so the idea was that we were gonna run on meth as well as hotel. I completely forgot how long these missions uh, actually are. So we're not going to run meth because this video is already almost 30 minutes long. We're going to go ahead and make a second one. Um, but there's a lot of content to go over. So this is a great chance to come out with a couple more ready or not videos. And obviously they're going to continue to come. And I'm, I'm going to be probably going live as well a little more often now that this update is out. And um, just so we can take all the content in. And uh, like I said, it, it, things are going to change. And we're going to most likely get more uh, before it comes out for standard edition owners as well so we'll just have to wait and see anyway i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you in the next one thank you so much